And we get to fight three Christmas trees. Oh, okay. they yeah. Need, they need a string of ornaments on them. They do, with a star on the top. With a star on the top. Hello everyone, I'm Steel. And I'm Teal. And we're with Studio Blue. In today's RPG Maker Let's Play, we take a look at Strangers of the Power 3 by Tuomo L. All right, so this is made in the Smile Game Engine, which is the same 3D engine we looked at a few months ago. Yes. So this is going to be a different take on things. Uh, I will say this is a very uh, art, indicative art style of Tuomo, uh, yes. the big eye characters. I, I do like the... Um... The custom art. I do. Uh, yep. It, it kind of gives me a dark cloud world building feeling. I don't know if that's what uh, we're looking for because she's standing on top of the world, literally holding a map. So I don't know. Um, we'll go down to config. Uh, I do notice there's no exit. There needs to be an exit. Ooh, yeah. yeah. Something to exit. All right, config. BGM's good. This good, good, good. All right. It looks like <clears> it's <throat> going to be an adventure game with a female protagonist. Which is good. Yeah. All right, let's jump in. Okay. Now loading. Okay. You use F analog stick or WAJ or arrow keys to move your character, interact with people using bottom button on gamepad or enter on keyboard. Uh, the participle the mm -hmm. needs to be in there somewhere. Mm -hmm. All right, let's do it. Oh, it's got a compass. Nice, compasses are good. All right, let's talk to this dude. Good morning. Oh, okay, so <clears throat> this nice. is my personal opinion. Tell me how you feel, too. Uh-huh. When we saw some of the earlier screenshots, one of the bigger issues that I had was that the art style for the busts don't measure, don't match the 3D at all. Okay. Um, do you feel that Tomo has made enough changes there, or if there's still a style clash? I think it's fine. You think so? Mm-hmm. Okay, good. That's a it's a good hurdle that's been overcome. Yeah. We'll see how it looks as things go on, but uh, that's good. I, I think. A contrast has been made enough, and I think it works. It does. All right, let's move on. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> this dungeon's been specifically designed to teach you all that you need to know, need to, uh, need to know, to become a successful adventurer. And spell check tomorrow. Anyway, let's start with the very basics. Come and find me a bit further ahead. Oh, that's nice. You, you can, can rope. Oh, okay, cool, cool, sweet. cool. If I need to do that, I will. Yeah. Uh, we are not using a gamepad. <laughs> Teal and I have been having ridiculous problems with the studio rig and gamepads. Yeah. Uh. I finally was able to get a solution using Xbox One controllers. Yeah. <laughs> but the Bluetooth on the rig doesn't work. <laughs> so I have to get a Bluetooth receiver. It's it, is, it is ridiculous. This is like a three thirty five hundred dollars. It's one issue after another. It is. It's one. So one day gamepad support for one Studio day. Blue. All right, here we go. Let's, let's do this. I like the colors and the way that. Oh yeah, it's good stuff. Isn't that very cool pretty? Very pretty. Okay, here we go. Oop. There we go. Mm. So the only thing is, Ooh, is I don't when like you, that direction yeah. change. That's that, no bueno. That um yeah. has that always screws me up. Yes. So. Yeah, rotate that 180 degrees right. if you can because it, uh, I just, yeah. You mm. never want to have a 180 degree jump between wow. scenes like that. Even yeah. if it's 90 degrees, 45 degrees, something. But 180, I guarantee you people will be holding up on that and doing that shit. And acting like an idiot. All right, here we go. <laughs> I know I would. I am. Okay, run Yay, with left run. button. Yay. We like running. Can we do an always dash option? That would be awesome. Oh, yeah. Oop, look okay. how awesome this looks. This is really nice. Wow. I love the depth. That is very pretty. Just very the, pretty. The different use of yeah. materials. Yes. I, I don't know how much of this is default to smile as opposed. Yeah, you got to stop doing this, man. This is not working. Um, I don't know how much of this is default and how much of this is custom, but it's really well applied. Yeah, it is. I have to admit, I'm impressed. Okay, so we go this way, and we go that way, and there's oh, our there, guy. there's our, our our teacher. <laughs> very good. Your navigation, your skill of navigate. There's definitely some uh language problem here. There's definitely some writing issue. That's kind of clunky the way the wording is, in my opinion. What do you think, Deal? Yeah, he basically he could say your navigation skill is right. great. Right. Or, or navigational. But skill of navigation, it's, yeah. I would definitely go through Tomo, um, and I noticed this with a lot of your early releases, 
you, you need to go through and kind of get tighten the writing up because it reads awkwardly. Okay, here we go. Let's see how you handle yourself in combat. Now, I've been told you've chosen sword as your weapon. Is that correct? Yep. I've been practicing it since I was little. Anybody catch them a spell? There. Well then, things will go really smoothly for you. Here's a sword for you. Put it to good use and vanquish the slime <gasps> to gain your first treasure. No! Yeah. That big pulsating green thing is not a wad of snot. It's a slime. No. We're going to kill it. Yeah, poor slime. That, I, oh! D no! I know. Received long sword. I, I can't watch this. <laughs> oh, no. And you so, made the slime like a little Christmas tree, too. He did. <laughs> okay, so I will say this. Kudos to you, Tumwell. Um, really good kudos. You don't auto-equip the weapon, yeah. so you're telling us to do it and how to do it. Either is acceptable. Okay, so boink, boinky, boinky, boink, boink, and long sword. Long sword. Ta-da. Yeah, there's an exit game. We need an exit game at the menu. Okay, here we go. Run and jump his ass. I guess I press the action button. Okay. I I'm okay with the battle Monster starting at appeared. touch. Okay. Yeah. Battle at touch, start battle that way. Okay, here we go. Now the only problem that we've ever had with smile game engines is that the battle system's very simple, but let's see how he does it, right? Um, attack? Sure. Right, smack that slime. I just ow. I know. This is not cool, poor slime. I know. He's just trying to do its thing. Oh, she can heal, she can guard, and she can items. Yeah, she can items. She can items. She items with the best of them. Slime attacks. Boop, boop. Does no damage. I'm okay with him doing nominal damage. Maybe one or two points. Let the slime feel like it's getting its way. It, it The slime needs to feel some validation. So let's have it take off some health off of our intrepid sword-wielding heroine. Right. Hmm. That's so cute. That is actually cute. Yeah. Yeah, I know that um, that's an upgraded style to the smile characters. I like that. The default smile is... Uh, that's good. That's good. Received a health proof. Yay! All right. La-da-da, la-da-dee. Da, 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 da. Doi-dee-doi. Wee! Okay. This is a save point. You can save on world map or safe areas like towns. However, in dungeons, you can only save by interacting with a save point. Yeah, I, uh, for the rest of this Let's Play, I am not going to harp on anything spelling, grammatical, or awkward phrasing. Just assume, developer, that you need to go through this with a comb and fix the wording. All right, let's hit the save point. Save point. Save point. Yes, we do want to save our game. Much saving. Yay. Yay. We're in the Adventure Labyrinth. <laughs> nice. That's a little generic, but not terrible. Okay, so we do we do 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 do. I'm not gonna run because, well, yeah, I'm not impatient with life. There we go. Here. Are there any treasures to be gained in here? I don't see any. No, just portals. Okay, warp points. Just throttles. And stairs. Lots of stairs. A very ha treasure. Come here, you. Mine. You've got Energizer. It's an Energizer bunny. Mmm, it keeps going and going Boom, and boom, going. boom, boom, <laughs> boom. Yeah, MP. Okay. Okay, cool. Nice, nice, nice. Very good. Very good job. All right, so who do 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 ba 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 do Nope, okay. Ah, da dee dee dee. That's a long way to go for just one treasure chest. Hmm. Yeah, uh -huh. I just, my only nervousness there is, is Tomo setting a precedent for long, windy, dead-end paths. I mean, <laughs> if he has long, windy, dead-end paths, we've said well, many times, it's okay if there's a treasure there. Yeah. But, yeah. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Do, um, do, 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 do. Oh, I'd love to be able to jump. Yeah, that'd be cool. Can I check the pot? Does the pot have anything? I don't know. I want to check the pot. I can't get to the pot. Can I? Wait. 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 There's a pot. Come on. Ah, God damn it. Oh. See, that's my complaint. Yeah. See, oh! Oh. Stop doing that. Okay, so I go this way? Nope, 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 yes, nope. What? Nope. We should be turn, able to go that turn, way. Turn, 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 No. Oh, it's uh, a blocking thing. Look at me, not knowing what I'm doing. Okay, can I make that? There we go, there's some stairs. 
All right, well, um, I'm going to give you bonus points, Tomo. Uh, um, I like the rotating thing. This is actually forcing me to think in 3D as opposed to 2D. And I'm going to admit, not too many Smile games that I have looked at have done that. So, hey. good job. Good job. I'll give you props on this one. Good job. All right, let's uh, do, 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 do. move on over here. I really do need. We need to get these game This pads is such a cool looking this is, dungeon. This is okay. Very well Just, done. It is nice. Right, save. Yay. Save. All right. Yay. Okay. Done. Oh, stop. Stop. Run. Run, woman. Her name oh, is Marion. Marion. It looks like there's something by your feet. I wonder what it is. You got any help? Oh, nice. Yep. Yeah. And that's it up there. Mm hmm. Hmm. I'm not sure I'm, about that. See, I would put some yeah. kind of wall, wall yeah. there just to show that it doesn't continue. And I'm not big into the whole abyss thing. I mean, I guess some games are like that. They've worked it out really well and they've made it work like Saga Frontier and stuff, but I've never been a fan of it. It's a personal thing. <laughs> and I like it. You like I, it? I well, like abyss games. It, it makes me think of the mini game that's inside of Fallout 4. Yeah. When you get to the robot camp. There it is then. Okay, cool. So we have a difference of opinion, and that's perfectly okay, Tomo. Uh, this is a valid style. Okay, so now I need to Whee! figure out which way to go. So we have that bit of ass hattery going on over there. Some magical portal thing. I love the water. Yeah, that's pretty neat. Um, what's over here? You know, I'm just going to do this for a while and run like this. Hi oh, bitter chest. All right, again, props to you. Props to you. Good job. Any game that makes me oh. think in 3D is, uh, is good yeah. shit. I'm glad that you can't fall off the edge. Oh, I'd That be, would suck. The, the lividness would be insane. But we don't, and that's cool. Okay, so do we go to here and... Oh, we do that. Okay, warp, warp point. Yay. Yay! So we warp to here... And you gotta warp using that one. Yeah. Okay. Whoa. Hey. Good yeah. Job. There we are. There we are. All right. Okay. Nice. Now is this like a thing that I do in the thing? In the thing? No. Oh, okay. You have to rotate the camera. Yeah. Yeah. I was just looking to see if we could. You yeah, see, that's, that's where the old treasure chest was. Yeah, so right. yeah. Oh. See, you're on an upper level now. Oh, this is so cool. All right. So good so far. Oh, there's our dude. Let's see if there's anything down here. There is not. Okay. Ooh, yeah. All right, so let's talk to our guy. All right, home that, slice. That's sensei. Yeah. Well done. You have found your way through the dungeon and bested the slime. I'm happy to hand you your adventurer's license. Easiest test. Oh, that's so fun. Ever. But you know what? Yeah. I'm okay. Yeah. I, I am okay. A little more complex. Too much. A little less complex. Eh. This was just well done. I like it. So, uh, now what? You don't want to take time off to celebrate? Well, there's this simple job. A nearby city of Pedmerton. Pedmerton? Pedmerton? Pit. Pit. Pitland. The Pit has petitioned us for aid. It seems monsters from nearby caves are invading them. Ooh. Huh. Go take care of it, Marion. Oh, you mean slaying few vermins and that sort of thing? I know it's not the most glamorous job, but the pay is nice, and it'll be great help to the locals. You're right. I'm sorry. I'll do it. So, where is the city? You can take the boat to reach the port of Pitt Merton. Pitt Merton. I'm never going to get it right. By tomorrow morning. Make the guild proud. That's right. <laughs> do it. Okay, so are we in... Oh! Our... Rotate that map! Oh. So, is this Pygmalion? I thought I heard a ship. It seems that I just missed it. Say, who are you anyway? I'm Adventurer. My name is Marion. I've been sent by Adventurer's Guild to deal with monsters in the city. Oh yeah, monsters. Yeah, that's true. I've been meaning to take care of that myself, but it's really rough all by yourself. I got to come back and heal myself way too often to make impact. <laughs> well, well. Well, I think that could help. I actually have a gift. I'm able to heal people. That's why I became an adventurer, to put it into good use. 
Really? That's just so awesome. I just know that we'll be best friends forever. Together, we can achieve great things. <laughs> and what's your name? Oh, my name's Branwen. Happy to meet you. Yay, new ally! Okay, so this is where I'm going to have to start getting uh, critical. I actually feel no connection to the story of the world. I understand Marion's an adventurer. Yeah. And she's off on an adventurer's guild to go do good things. Yeah. But that's so generic. And it's presented so simply. Yeah. I'm actually not... I'm filled with more questions about the world. The world seems very... I don't want to say flat because that's not the right word. The world seems very undefined. Well, we haven't really had a chance to do anything yet. We went through the... Right. Uh, inter dun in inter entrance dungeon. Okay. Intro <laughs> dungeon. And... Well, th th I mean, that's just kind of a tutorial. We, we got our, our chops. So now I expect now to see a story and to see character development. Right. That sort of thing. Right now. Right. Starting right now. Right. And we will continue forward. Yeah. But my, my point is, is that everything in that opening dungeon, which is very well constructed on a level, yes. as a level, was just very... It didn't have personality, that's it. And I'm going to bring the beginning of Wild Arms, the original Wild Arms, mm -hmm. when you introduce yourself to the character of Jack, Jack the Adventurer. Jack the Adventurer, his story starts off with a generic dungeon. He walks into a mine or a ruin or something. Uh huh. He falls into a pit, and while the screen scroll is telling you about a little bit about, just a tiny bit about Jack and his story, mm -hmm. he's running from traps, arrows are hitting him in the ass, walls are closing in behind wow. him, and you kind of, you know, he's grabbing his hat, making sure his hat doesn't fall off his head, so you're getting the personality of the character and the world while you're going through this opening portion. And I think that's my complaint just so far. I agree with you, Teal, we gotta see where this goes. But the opening portion is too generic. It's too personality uh, lack of personality. I, I see that. Yeah. I, I see that point. So, Tomo, if you hit that harder, then that impact will be there, and people will feel that connection. Yeah. And by the time Marion gets to Branwen, we're like, yeah, let's do this thing. All right, so let's do this thing. I love the fountain. Look how pretty this that is. This is so... Pretty. Oh, it's and so just pretty. nice, and I like it a lot. That is so pretty. Wow. Look at that. We got an inn. We got buildings. We got, oh God. We got a little thing here, and we got a little thing and here. And we got a treasure chest. Which will be opened because that's what we do. Got some diners. Yay! Cool. By the way, that's actually his, uh, that's, that's Tomo's uh, currency of choice in all his games. A diner. Ah. So, um, this is actually missing something, and I'm just realizing this. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, what is it missing, Teal? It's missing people. Yeah, this and is... And animals. Yeah. There's no life here. There's no life. The only life, I guess, would be the chimney smoke. Yeah. But, seriously, there's going to be have to be people walking around. Right. Dogs, cats, birds, yeah. butterflies, squirrels. Yeah. Children. Yeah, ducks. Ducks. Duck, very important. Yeah, ducks are important. And especially since, and I remember when you were talking about this game a few months ago, Tomo, you mentioned that all of your buildings are rabbit holes. They're all um, rabbit holes like in Sims. Right. And that's fine. That's a okay design choice sure. that some people like, some people don't like, but it's valid. However, if you're going to have no in building interiors in towns like this, if they're all rabbit holes, uh -huh. you absolutely have to have life in the town. Yes, you do. In fact, it's even more important. This is not Fallout 76. I'm going to get flamed for that. Oh. <laughs> can I help you with something? Yes. Let's see what we can get. We can buy health brew. Mm -hmm. All right. Antidote. Antidote. Why so expensive? Why are antidotes expensive like this, that? This, I'm sorry. I've always believed that status curative items should be at least equal to, if not less, than your basic health potion. That's what I, I believe. My, my, my philosophy right. is a curative items like that cost less than the equivalent healing item. Exactly, because you are, mathematically speaking, more likely to get hit with a negative status ailment yeah. than you are to achieve the amount of damage necessary to heal with the starting health potion. So, antidotes You want to buy it? Be... We got, like, 50... Yeah, I'm sorry. 
Ten. Ten, yes. Ten. 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 I'd let you get away with 15 if you could convince me that poison was really rare. Yeah. But I'm going to agree with Teal that 10 is the best price. Yeah. Um, I'm not going to buy anything just yet, Teal. But... Okay. Good to know. All right. So we... So we join out. Okay. Thank you. Please come again. And that was a little jarring. I hope we can make that a little smoother. Okay. Go in here. And this should be like... Okay. What? Oh, it's a thing. Okay. Uh -huh. A bandana. Bandana. It raises defense by two. I like that. We might get that. Yeah, I think or, we should get that. Or a, a buckler. buckler, which raises defense by two and evasion by ten. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, so again, economy is very important. Yeah, and is. this is something that is hardly ever addressed in our Let's Plays. Uh huh. But here I can really see it. Yes. 17 diners for something that raises defense by two. Only five more diners. Yeah. For something that raises defense by two and evasion by ten. Yeah. This, in every way, shape, and form, is the better choice. Right. This needs to raise something else, not not necessarily by ten, in order to justify it being, like, not five. Or yeah. drop it down to, like, five. Right. So, lower the price of the bandana or add something extra to it. Yeah, maybe that increases magic or luck or whatever. Mm -hmm. But, let's see what our stats are. Yeah. Yeah, so stats, stats, stats. 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 Marion, uh, okay, so we have attack, element attack, wisdom, defense, agility, accuracy, evasion. I have no idea what those things do, but you got lots of stats to choose from. Uh, blessed by her birth with the ability to heal people, longing to become an adventurer, she trained hard with the sword. Oh, and there's Brynwen, a warrior who's very skilled in combat, the leader of their village watch group. Sounds good. Yeah, sounds good. Sounds good. Sounds good. No complaints. All right. All right. So, before I buy anything else, I want to get an idea of what monsters are here. Oh, let's see what's in the end. This is just going to be the price for the rabbit hole. Get in there. <laughs> Would okay. you like to stay? It it's is 10, ten diners. Okay. I like that. that that's, a, that's good. Yes. Very good starting price for an inn. Mm -hmm. All right, so we got this town here. Who that? Oh, we can get inside. Oh, okay, so you oh. can go inside. So, it's just the shops that are the rabbit holes. Okay. So it's a little better, but damn, son. All right, deal. <laughs> okay, so you need some more clutter in there and yeah. stuff because that's a big old empty space mm -hmm. and it's not going to be utilized for a cutscene. Right. So fill it up. Yeah. Put all kinds of crap in there. Put it up. Mm -hmm. Put and some more people in there too. Yeah. It's like the one guy. Yeah. Hello, you must be from the Adventurers Guild. I've petitioned your aid to defeat the monster. And that's all you get. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Okay, there's a missed dialogue opportunity There really here. is. There's a lot missed here. Because the, the two uh, girls, Branwen and Marion, right. could chat with the guy. You could get some more insight into their personality and their worldview, etc., to yes. the dialogue. Yeah. And learn a little bit more about the town and maybe some town history with this dude. Exactly. This so is there. your chance to create that rich world we were talking yeah, about. Some Instead world of having and... this home slice just say, Welcome to standing up class. And you failed. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Do, Bonus do, points do, if you get where that's from. Do, 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 do. All right. Uh, so we have this over here. That's a church. That is a church. You haven't been a naughty girl, so you don't need to visit church. Oh! <laughs> That's funny, and well, I better see a payoff. Well, 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 yeah, we'll well, well. You're unable to open the door. Yeah. Okay. Well. Please. Something. Ah! Well, we, we, we get We get teased. We get dick teased so much about Wells. <sighs> Actually, uh, let's see. Is there any goodies here? There's no? going to be an active well yeah. in every town in my game. That's right. Rose and Hearts will have all the active wells. Yes. And there's sparkles back there behind that house. Where? Keep on going forward. No, wrong way. To the right. Oh, okay. That's not forward, but I got it. It was forward to where you were facing. Ah, I see. Okay, hold on. Let's see how we do this. Um, Got to go here, here, and... Oh, wait. Okay, so it's right by the edge of town. No one to exit town. All right, there we go. Whee. Something by your feet. Okay. An energizer. Yes, we need those. It's the gift that keeps on giving. Oh yeah. All right, so we got this, and uh, 
We got that. So and then we, we can got... buy stuff. Yeah. Oh, I'm getting the We're getting the bucklers. bucklers. Buckler. Pond. I like how the, the uh the menu remembers your selection. Yeah, it's actually kinda cool. Yes. Uh, now we equip said bucklers. bucklers. So we can buckle. Yeah. There, there we go. go. Red one's chopper? That was cute. That was very cute. Alright, so we go here and we're going to save while we're in the town. Yes. Of many surprises. Not really. So no, there's this town has a population of one, yeah. Uh, Fix that. Yeah, yeah. Like next update. Mm. Alright. Here we go. Where are we at? What are we doing? Well, we're loading. We are. Oh, roll map. Wow. Ooh, cool. It, it's got little pathways! I like it. That's cool. I have no idea where I'm supposed to go, though. Not even a little. You're supposed to kill monsters. Oh, just randomly mar mar In the nearby forest? Okay. It was hurting the town? I guess so. Well, th this jackass appeared. Oh. Another one of them. It's a Christmas tree slime. <laughs> eh, he what missed. Is? Wonder what Brenwyn does. She does clear. Of course. It's all enemies a bit weaker than a single strike attack. Sure, I can go with that. Smack. Die. Yay, they jump up and down. That's adorable. There's gotta be something else they can do. Come on. Give oh. us victory poses. That, that show us their personality. What's up, Teal? Uh, on that uh, battle screen, uh, there was a sign in the background, and yeah. now I don't see a sign on the world map. Um, yeah, the battle scene's probably... Okay, so the monsters are going to be in the forest at, by that town. Okay. Like that. Yeah, see, there's a sign. There, there. is, there is. Hmm. That's cool. But I think we're supposed to kill monsters that's right near the town. Okay. So you yeah, can't, I actually don't really can't go too far. No. Okay. That's what they said. There were monsters invading the town, so you have to kill monsters around the town. Okay. And you're not around the town. So your your thought, Teal, is that I just spend a couple of minutes just doing this? Yeah. Except not that. Okay. So this is what we're supposed to do. Oh. Yeah. You say that with certainty, my love. In other words, you don't know either because there's no... What is it missing? What do we need? We need, I don't know, critical path or something? Or... <laughs> we definitely need that. Uh, <laughs> we need a journal. We need a quest yes, journal. Yes, we need like, a quest bad. journal. I, even if it's an item and, that and, we have and, to uh, use. And a big marker arrow going, here, yeah. here, kill the monsters here. Because we did not get any direction from Branwyn or Mr. Smokey Jacket over there. Yeah, none. So none. we're so, just I mean, going to wander in this area because I would assume that um, if they're invading the village, then the monsters are nearby. Right. And us going far afield on the map is not going to be very helpful to that village. Right. And that may not be the case at all. You may be sitting here, Tomo, watching the video going, why aren't they going here? Why aren't they going here? Well, we have... Because you didn't tell us to. Right. So we're doing right. our best guess with the limited information that we've been given. Right. So, hmm. I mean, at least the battles are quick. I don't feel like we're being yeah. punished. We're, we've lost a little bit of HP. That's not that bad. Not really. I think this, the green slime should have a star on top. It should be. What's his that, a tent? Ooh, that is not. That is the entrance mine. to a mine. You weren't able to open the door. Well, yeah, we're fuck. not ready. Yeah. You're not worthy. <laughs> I really, okay. You have given us about six doors so far that we can't open. Yeah. So my question is this. If we're not going to go in the towns, if we're not going to go in the houses in the town, is it because you haven't built them? And if so, I'll address that at the end of the uh, Let's Play. Or is it just they're all locked? Yeah. And when you start seeing a lot of locked doors, I don't know about you, but I stop checking. I just wonder why all the doors are locked. Yeah, That's me. I was like, why, why are all these doors locked? Yeah, if this is an area that you haven't finished working on, then just don't put it in there. Or say this area is not done. But anyway. I was I was thinking about all the doors in the town. Yeah. You know, I, my, my thought process is, well, why are these doors locked? Right, like that. See? You know, is is there a reason yeah. why? Can I get into them later? Is, is it just the people aren't home? Right. I, I want to know why the door is locked. Right. I like the ten diners. That's pretty clever. Yeah. Okay, what is this? This is such a cool... Wow. 
the um I I can't finish the thought. Yeah. The um floor tiles here. Oh yeah, it's, those it's, are mm -hmm. so pretty. This is all really good stuff. Okay. Horrible monsters have attacked my poor family. I had to flee the old cave that had been a home to my family for generations. I had to escape so fast that I couldn't even bring the remains with them, and they were left entirely for the monsters to feast yeah. upon. Yeah. Since then, I've been haunted in my dreams about them not having to rest for not receiving proper burial rites. Can you help me out? Can you go into the cave and gather the remains of my family? Aye, aye, aye. Yay. Sure. Great. Here's the key that opened it. Oh, I had exactly not. What? 92 relatives. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, God! <laughs> it's fucking Rainbow City all over again with the flowers. <laughs> That's a bit much! Holy moly! Well, we're not gonna go get all 92 relatives, no, but I can tell you that right now. Yeah. Alright, I have a couple of thoughts here, but I want to see if it opens the door to this place. Okay, it does. Yeah. Okay, so... Oh, by the way, the doors went through the rocks. That was cute. That was awesome. Um, okay, so basically... All right. <sighs> Dissect this. <laughs> uh, doors that are locked with a key that you're going to get in a quest or not, on the description of the door, just say, you know, hey, there's a key that fits here, and then have a character go, hmm, we need the key. Yeah. That way I don't think it's just lazy dev work. <laughs> Second, 92... Yeah, that's that's my no. my comment too. Ninety two with exclamation point and question mark. Yeah, I if, mean seriously, that's a lot. That is, if this Whew. was if this was like a game extent, like a game reaching quest where the entire game we're doing the side quest. Right. Where it's like you know there are ninety two pieces of flan throughout the entire world. Please go find them. Uh -huh. Okay, I can accept that. You have said there's 92 remains in a single dungeon. <laughs> so, there what, is why, no... Why did you do this? 92? <laughs> if you went and rolled two Dungeons and Dragon dice and just want the first number you wrote with, don't ever do that again. I, I have zero oh, interest man. at the beginning of a game going oh. into a dungeon and finding 92 dead bodies. Thank you. I just that I don't even want to do it. Okay, we're and, backing out and going yeah. to go kind yeah. of complete the first quest, which whatever is whatever that is. To kill kill the, mon the monsters to well, make the village safe. You see, now that teal is where I'm beginning to think there's a problem, and I want this game to prove me wrong. What? I'm thinking that all we're supposed to do is go out and get quests, like in Skyrim. Oh. And if that's the case, you know, because I don't see, because I don't see a direction. I'm assuming we're just going around the countryside. Fulfilling quests and saving people. Okay. I'm hoping the game proves me wrong on that because if that's the case, this is not really doing its job. All right. Well, we got it, I know she's in the Adventurers Guild, right? And she should pick up on quests, but uh, first of all, is that all there is? Right. And second of all, uh, the the quests are not clearly defined. Uh, okay. No. Sure, this uh, mine quest is, but. In the very beginning, you're telling us to kill monsters, and we don't know where where to, to, yeah. to do this the and, lack, and, and collect our quest reward. The lack of focus and direction is really noticeable right now. And I, I admit, I did jump the gun, and Teal wanted to see where things go, but where we're now, I think my argument from beginning is kind of valid. This It just seems... Okay. I'm going to reserve judgment Well, let's longer. go ahead and see what that tree is. Yeah, it's probably the Deku tree. Let's go back to that first village. All right, so let's go to the Deku tree. Okay. It's a nice tree. Oh, it's so That's peaceful. actually really nice. It's got a face on it. I wonder if it's yeah. one of the old gods from Game of Thrones. It's... What a strange tree. It almost looks like a person. And that's all we get. Hmm. Okay. See, I... Well... Does the tree talk? I, I've got nothing. I, I would love for the tree to talk. I would or... love for something. E hmm. Even a... This tree gives me a, a funny feeling in my tummy. Something. Okay, so... Uh, Go back around. Yay, back on here. I, I want to know... Okay, are we supposed to kill 10 monsters or 20 or whatever to make the village feel safe? Uh, that hasn't been defined. Right. This is, this is a rather undefined quest. Right. And since it's the initial quest after the tutorial, yeah, it sets a 
unsavory precedent for the game. Yeah. I'm trying to choose my words carefully here because it's not bad. It's just not. I don't know what I'm doing. It is not like a freaking you know okay. go out and bash shit. At least we're getting diners. Yeah, which we're gonna go spend on the end. Okay, so how's that? Oh, so cute. Yeah, it is very cute. Graphically, it's nice. Yes, it is. No problem with the graphics. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> cheerful, cheerful music. Very well put together. Like that. Yeah, I've got no problem with the aesthetics. All right, uh, so we're gonna save, right? Yeah, yeah, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. And we save. Yay, save. Did I save over two? It doesn't matter. I'm not sure. Yeah. It doesn't matter. All right, so we'll go north. This Maybe this north. will bring us someplace interesting. Okay, so we got a mansion and we got a bridge city. Which one do you want to go to, Teal? Uh, bridge city. Bridge city. All right, neenie, neenie. Or that. that was, hey, cool. Okay. It's gonna happen. Yeah, we'll just smack them around for a bit. Christmas trees. Yeah. There we go. Do, do, do. Wait, what? Oh. Oh, it's a person! <laughs> oh, gosh. I didn't even... I couldn't even tell. It's a person on the bridge. Okay. Wow. Okay. Maybe an exclamation point or something above their head. I don't know. All right. I... <clears throat> I've heard great stories about magical treasures inside this tree, but that story must be bogus. It was just a weird looking tree when I saw it. What tree? The, the tree like we went south and There's saw. no this. You don't use this. Don't when you're talking about something that's miles away, you use that or something else. Yeah. Uh, what? And you can't you And can't, that's all we get. Yeah, because you can't go up there. You gotta go back down. And, and talk to that magical tree. Yeah, but I'm going to the damn... It's a frog! It a man-eating frog! Yep. <laughs> it's a Marion-eating frog. Oh, uh, yeah, well, I don't think so. She's too much of a scrapper to let that frog eat her. She can do it. Woo! Do-do-do! I think they leveled uh, up. Yay. Okay, so we got that. Okay, so Ooh. now we have this... It's snow! Is that a pink one? Snow and ice. What is that? It's an owl. That's cute. That is cute. They got little helmets. This is a north checkpoint. The area ahead is extremely cold. You need some special equipment or else you'll freeze to death. Oh, wow. Hey, do you sell the equipment? Who does? Who sells the equipment? Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can't go into the north without protective equipment. You'll freeze to death. Yeah, no shit. Your All friend right. just told me that. So, uh, tiny little itty bitty inside space. Right, Teal? Right. Looks like a goddamn mansion on the outside. Well, it, it's huge. Yeah. yeah. Uh, oh, boy. Oh, well. All right, so, uh, so let's go see the Deku tree. Yeah. I guess we get equipment for the Deku tree because they weren't selling anything. Yeah. And we get to fight three Christmas trees. Oh, okay. they yeah. Need, they need a string of ornaments on them. They do, with a star on the top. With a star on the top. And, one of the, st and the star needs to go limp whenever they're damaged. Yeah, <laughs> and maybe some of the ornaments will bust. <laughs> Why don't anyone ever have a game where we fight the Christmas trees? That would be cool. That would be awesome. I know that Tomo made that San Mrs. Santa Claus game. We just needed to have a freaking uh, uh, uh tree villain. Tree, tree villain. Yeah. Christmas tree villain. Yeah. Could even think of a cute name for him if you want. All right, that ought to do it. So, you know, battle system is pretty much normal. Yeah. Normal turn base. Um, no complaints, really. It, nothing spectacular, but nothing bad. Okay, and I never need to ever buy an antidote, ever, again. She has So if I would have bought your 50 diner antidote, I'd be coming through the monitor and killing you. So, heal, heal, and back out. And back there you out. go. All right, we're going to talk to the deco tree. Okay, neat. Nice. All right. So peaceful. Give us your treasure. What a strange tree. It almost looks like a person. Well, there went that idea. So, let's go back to the first town and ask the dude if we've killed enough monsters. Smoking Jack? 
Yeah, smoking jacket. <laughs> you know, they're gonna have frog legs for dinner. <laughs> there we go. You're making a difference, Brandwin. Heal thyself, physician. Happily Is, heals. Hey, um. Yeah, yeah. Not, not you, Teal. Tomo or Dross Ray, anyone who's worked in the Smile Engine, if you're watching this, is it actually the way the Smile Engine works where it's 2D effects transposed over a 3D battle engine? Because yeah. that's awful. Yeah. I, I, <laughs> it's a, it's a camera, rotate, and a net, and rotate, yeah. and net. And a, a, I'm, getting, I, I'm getting dizzy. It, it, it is, <laughs> and, and if it really is just like animation sprites over a... Uh -huh. ugh, that's mm, lazy. That is... Yeah, we're talking like <laughs> Final Fantasy VII lazy. Woo! That's the Wayback Machine. Seriously. All right, where's our smoking jacket guy? Right. Oh, well, first we're going to heal. Oh, of course. Because that's what we do in this game. Yay! Yes. To... Ten. Da -da -dee 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 and it's cheap because that's the only way to really heal. Whee! And jump on out. Yeah. Pop on out. Poot on out. And then, hey! Because, yeah. Yay! Okay, very good. Good job. All right, so now we're going to go talk to Smoking Jacket Guy, who's going to yes. give us direction and tell us how many monsters we've killed and how many we need to kill, and it's going to be wonderful. I can talk to him. Okay. Okay. Hello, you must be from the Adventurer's Guild. I petitioned your aid to defeat the monster. Uh... Just for that, I'm going to steal your books. What? So... Still nothing. I checked it out, but nothing appears ordinary. Wait, did she just say what I thought she said? Yeah. Out of the ordinary. Okay, I was about to say. Okay, that's cool. I can work with that. We got an energizer from the pot. Oh, I like that. Good heroes steal from Absolutely. townsfolk. That's how it works in forever. Okay, one monster. So, okay. <laughs> so, Teal, let's go over this um, just so we're kind of on the same page. Okay. We went south to the Deku Tree. Nothing, even though somebody up at the bridge north mentioned it, right? Yeah. Right. Nothing we, happened. We went to the other town, but we didn't go all the way in, so we probably need to go in deeper. Uh -huh. We just talked to the guy who sent us to the mine of 92 bad things. Right. And to the north, there's the girl blocking the bridge. Who's saying, go go talk to the tree. Right, and which nothing happens. Yeah. And there's the mansion outpost... Uh, where they say, get warm clothes before you go on the other side of the wall or you're going to die. Right. Okay. Um, yeah, and we so, have no idea where to get warm clothes either. Right. So, here Back we are, guys. This, this is the State of the Union right here. So, obviously, we have to explore that town some more. And hopefully there they'll find out about the monster that we I have to fight. I hope so. All right, so go... Boo -doo -boo -doo -boo -doo. Boopy doopy doopy with really, really cool floor tiles. Yay! And lots of Christmas trees. Yay! In a row. Yay! Yay! Wait, what? I don't know what I'm they're, doing. They're, they're blocked. They are. They're blocking. The door, what the, the heck? Wait, okay, hold on. Can I get I behind them? I guess you go them? behind them. I get behind them. Okay. Best wow. arbory. The, <laughs> whoever it is who is a city planner, <laughs> he needs to be in the stocks. <laughs> Now. <laughs> you're fired. You're fired, dude. And they... Oh, oh okay. Wow. Well, we'll have to go get the headbands upgrades. back yeah. from the first time. All right. And you get... Right. Smirky, 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 you heard, smirky. saw that? I saw that. They, yep. they got kicked out. Yeah, they did. All right, so this okay. is potions. Potions. Health brew. Ooh, health juice. Ooh, Energizer. And, a, and Miracle Salve revives. Should we get one? One. Let's get one. One. Okay. All right. I, I feel like I... Money well spent. Yes. Okay. So, all right. Boo -da -boo -da -boo -da -boo -da all right. So you know about the monster, right? You haven't been on a girl. Okay. That's gonna get old real fast. This is not a hentai game. Make sure you rotate all the way around so that you can see behind houses and behind the right, church. Right, right, right. Right. I'll go over there and check. Uh huh. A second. Controls here aren't exactly easy, honey. Well, because you're supposed to have a gamepad. Yeah, you really are. Yeah. And you know what? That's all right. That's all right. More games are going that way anyway, and. I think the next iteration of RPG Maker will probably be more gamepad focused anyway. Probably. I hope so. Wow. Um, okay, so not only is the town lifeless like the first one. Yeah. But 
uh, unless I'm missing something, and I'm gonna look around a little bit longer. I don't see anything. Okay, yeah, city planner is a wow. freaking idiot. Okay, let's 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 fire him. Like oh my nobody God. does that with houses. Wow. Oh wow. No, that's oh, and, and I can't we can't open, open the door. So no shit, you can't open it. It's the wall. <laughs> Screw you, player! You can't open, open the doors. Door. Um. Okay. Fuck you. Fuck you both. Fuck you. Okay. Do I go in here? Is this where the plot is? Is the plot in here? Hold on. Let's see if I can move this around. All right. Plot's in here, right? Nope. The plot is not. Wow. In here. So I don't know wait, where the plot wait. is. Okay. This is called the search for plot. Yeah, and I, we've gone to every place, right, Teal? Yeah. So there's just this humdiggery do right who, here. Who, who wants us to retrieve ninety two? That can't be it. Please, in the name of God, that cannot be the plot right now. <laughs> oh, God! That cannot be it. All right, I'm going to search a little bit more, because obviously I'm missing something. I mean, shit, it won't be the first time. Okay, so we have this house right here. Nope, can't open it. Wonderful. Um, and we're nope. not naughty. Okay, we can't do that. I mean, okay, well, that's, well, it. that's that's the potion shop, that's yeah. the equipment shop, those and are the doors it. that don't open, there's the, I, I, I don't know. Okay, so we're down here. Oh my god, this can't be it. Please, Tomo, you cannot be doing this. Talk to this. Strange Street, no, okay, uh, we're gonna go north again, we've obviously missed something. Okay, here we go. Meep, 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 Go to the left a little further. Oh, look right. at another dead frog. Yay, Yay. kill the frog. We need like an auto battle. <laughs> spam in the Z button. <laughs> auto battler. Rrr. Most excitement I've ever had. Yay. Okay. Oh, I'm going to hit the window button twice. Oh my god, I'm about to be a messing glitch. No, that's it. This is what I get. That's what you get. Um, I'm going to escape. Yay, ran away. That was cute. Yeah, it was. Okay, uh, that's it. Holy shit. Wow. Holy shit. Okay, let's move the map around. No, no. No, the... <laughs> I'm gonna start escaping now because fighting on the world map ceased to be fun. Well, um, there's no point. Yeah, there's no point. I, I just, I got nothing. I mean, I can't even enter the lake. It'd be cool if there was, like, something in the yeah. lake I can interact with. What um monster? Because, again, I, I don't want to go in here Are and get... we supposed to go in there and do this? I... Because that's the only thing left to do. Right! Other than just, we're fighting random monsters on the overworld, and I don't see the point of that because uh, Smoking Jacket guy hasn't said anything. Right. Um, so I don't know. So. You got me. It, you got me. Yeah, you I'm got stuck, it. I'm yeah. stuck, Tomo. You got um, me. It honestly seems like, Tomo, what you want us to do at this point is go in here, yeah. fight monsters, and collect 92, 92 skeletons. I. I don't want to do that. Oh. I'm going to be honest. I don't know any player that would want to do this. <laughs> and here's the thing, okay? <clears throat> Obviously, we're stuck. So, Tomo, please let us know what it is you have to do next. But this is going to lead me to something I've got to say. What? And this is not just to Tomo. This is to any developer who comes to us. I understand there are release deadlines, and I get that. Um, this game was released on Steam on May 1st yesterday. Okay. We are looking at a gold product. Right. Oh. I don't think this is even remotely gold. Oh. Not even remotely. Nope. You know, this nope. this this is this is a beta. Yeah. Yeah. This this just doesn't have enough done to it to make it interesting and right. uh playable. Right. I mean, yeah, okay, playable. Okay. But it functions, which is why it's in beta yeah, and not alpha. It functions, but this is just boring. Yeah. And the thing is this. I've played games where you go around the overall from location to location with only sort of a, a vague goal. And you have to kind of collect your pieces. That's the very basis of The Legend of Zelda, Zelda 2, The Adventure of Link. But there's a lot to do. And you get a feeling of momentum. And you get a feeling of being pushed through things. This is just running around a world map fighting battles and finding locations only to be told they're irrelevant to us. Yeah. That is the, and again, I'm just being critical here, the opposite of fun. And I, 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 I'm sorry. Uh, I 
personally would not have put a game like this out to the public. I never would have, even early access. Yeah. You know, using Steam's early access, which I philosophically disagree with. Mm-hmm. Um, I, this is not worthy of being called a release title, a gold, a gold title. This is not gold. It's just not. So my advice to Mo is let's make this a game. Yeah. And not a proof of concept beta and just go and do whatever we can with it. Yep. So, everyone else in the comments, what do you think? If we're missing something tomorrow, well, correct us. We'll revisit this, please. Right, right. Cause, I, I don't want to wow. think this is what you've done. <laughs> so, um, as for everyone else in the comments, let us know. If we missed anything, please let us know. Uh, let's see if we can make Tomo's first 3D game the best it can be. Right. All right. Well, if you like what you saw, let us smack down the like button below. Subscribe to our channel. Consider supporting us on Patreon. Connect with us over Discord, Facebook, Twitter, and we will see you in the next video. See you next time.